The new voice isolation feature in Teams meetings uses AI to filter out any other noises that might be in the room behind you, whether it's other people's voices or dogs or whatever's going on. It's going to just focus so your voice is the only thing that comes through. First, you have to create a voice profile. So go to the three dot menu and choose settings. Then go down to recognition. And if you haven't yet created a voice profile, you can go right here. It takes about 30 seconds. So I'm going to choose create a voice profile. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to read this right here. So I'll say start voice capture. Hi teams. I'm going to speak for a moment to help you get to know my voice better. And then I click end voice capture. It says it's learning my voice. Great. It says your voice profile is used to suppress background noises in teams meetings. Now I'll click close. You can see right here, I can remove it or I can update it and I can even export these things. Now we're going to go into the teams meeting and show how this works. So now I'm in a meeting and if I go up to microphone, I'm going to drop this down and under noise suppression, you see voice isolation. So it used to just be background noise only, but now if I choose voice isolation, sort of the AI behind the scenes is going to filter out everything except my voice because it has that data that it trained on my voice. If you want to keep up with all the latest Microsoft updates and tips and tricks, subscribe to my channel and then just ring the bell so you get all the latest videos that I post.